It's five in the morning and we're up to photograph sunrise here at Lake Titicaca. The al I'm gonna blame the altitude on this one, but we hiked all the way down to the waterfront and I forgot my tripod. So hiking back up to the homestay. Got the tripod, now we're in business. <laughs> If you watched yesterday's episode, you remember I was shooting here and the light was completely different yesterday. I was shooting into sunset, so the light was a little bit harsher and I was doubling up on grad filters. Today I'm doing something a little bit different because the light's different. Right now I've got a three stop grad ND filter. That's a hard grad because it's a flat horizon. And I've got a six stop ND to kind of like slow down the water here and make it a little bit moodier of a scene. The light this direction, unfortunately, isn't killer. It is kind of amazing straight into the sunset. So I might play with that a little bit as well. And yeah, I guess we got about 15 minutes to shoot photography here. It's crazy how short the light is around the equator. Absolutely mind blowing. You really, really got to get your shots dialed in quick and probably shouldn't be talking to YouTube as much. I should be shooting, but I'm talking to you guys because I like you guys. <laughs> Gracias por todo. Yeah, Hasta la próxima. Yeah. Sí. Gracias. La comida fue excelente. Yeah. I had such a good time here on Amantani Island and now we're heading back towards Puno, back on the boat right now. Um, we're stopping on the way to Puno first though at a place called the Udos Islands, the Reed Islands. These islands completely made out of reeds. It's really cool, so let's jump on the boat and head that way. <laughs> Buenos dias. Buenos dias. Kamisaraki! Waliki! We are on the floating reed islands. It's so spongy! No, no, no. These islands are so, so cool, and the only way to make them look cooler than being here on the ground is through Fido's eyes. Put it up in the air. Dutch clogs. <laughs> 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 Yeah. 
funds over on Lake Titicaca. It's been really, really good. Right now we're heading back to Puno. We're gonna probably just take a chilled out afternoon, which I'm kind of looking forward to, to be honest. <laughs> So the bad news is the stomach bug I had is kind of back. The good news is Jeff and I took like the whole afternoon off to work and I got two vlog edits done. So I think basically from here on out, you're gonna get the dailies again. The daily vlog should punch out basically here for the next probably month, I think, from here through Peru all the way through Norway. So be prepared for constant dailies starting again. Um, altitude's still crushing me. I've never been crushed like this by altitude on any of my trips to Peru or Bolivia. So yeah, struggling still today. Um, right now we're going into like the pedestrian part of Puno and we're gonna get some dinner. I'm probably not gonna eat that much, but we're gonna get some dinner. A uh, bit of a short episode today, but uh, yeah, when you're not feeling great, that's how it goes. Tomorrow, though, we're heading to Cusco, and I'm so excited for that. I'd have to be on my like deathbed, deathly ill not to enjoy Cusco. One of my favorite places anywhere in the world, and I'm so stoked to be going back there. So check into tomorrow's episode for a little bit of Cusco action. I'll see you guys there. Peace.